want to see someone systematically disprove everything you have read about trading stocks and expose how and why you will consistently lose money if you aren't doing it right? Click the link in the description to check it out for yourself. But now for today's video. The question, how can I start stock trading as my full-time career? Answer by Broadchalk. Honestly, I would suggest you to start as part-timer initially. I have no intention to discourage you or something but I said so as we all know that stock market does have a certain amount of risk in it. Once you start working as a part-timer, try gaining as much knowledge as you can through books websites, blogs, tutorials, videos, etc. Make sure that you try to cover as many platforms as you can, which in return help you get confident and prepare you for trading. One more important thing that you need to keep in mind is that you need a good broker. It is very much essential. You can choose companies that offer low rates for trading in high quantities with no much advisory and less of interaction. These are RSKV, Zerodah and Composite Edge. However, when you need the best of features and advisory it's better to go with a full-service broker. Codex Securities have a good name in the market however, I've not known of anyone much who use their service. Mainly cause they are more into banking. Angel Broking has some good trading platforms with good advisory and machine learning based suggestions which be the index values also. So to begin with they are good and you can make a lot of profit without losing out on much. EFL is also a great service offered but I think it's mostly for well-seasoned investors. They too, have a good mobile trading platform and my chacha has been using them since he is a stock market pro. Answer by, C Chauvin. I will give you a general idea into what it takes to be a full-time trader. You should know the amount of efforts and discipline which would be expected out of you in order to be among those 5% traders who can consistently mint money from the markets. You need to have experience of watching and analyzing hundreds of charts. This is very important in understanding that the stock market does not make binary moves. If there is a rally then certainly there would be pullback slash retracements before the Intel rally just continues. Mastering the art of reading previous structure. Stock market has memory. All the future moves of a stock is just a reaction to what happened in the past. You need to be able to identify previous support slash resistance levels in order to predict upcoming potential reversals or breakouts. GAN level. Fibonacci retracements, Cypher and Gartley patterns are some of the best tools the trader can bet upon. Practice lots of case studies on these. Read books written by W.D. Gann himself to understand what immense potential these tools hold. If you want to be full-time trader then do not trade like a part-timer. You should at least have 35 log rupees to start with. I have seen people start with 10k or 20k and end up losing all of it due to following reasons. Using high leverage, having tight stop loss due to lesser capital, which leaves no room for the stock to retrace and move in your favor. Always begin with positional slash swing trading before you get into intraday. If you see all the professional traders around the world they all are positional slash swing traders. Till now I have seen only one intraday trader from India who is making consistent profit rest all are short term traders. Do not leave your current occupation in order to be a full time trader. Do paper trading for a couple of months, experiment what works and what does not. But you still cannot quit your job because though paper trading is beneficial but as you did not have lit market exposure which is important in testing your emotions, discipline and patience. For this you can start trading in commodities if you have day job. Concentrate on price action rather than looking for signals from indicators. All indicators show delayed picture of what has already happened. Only price action helps us to trade on the basis current market sentiment. When people are buying you should look for an opportunity to sell and when people are selling you should look to go on. You need to trade market sentiments and think like a businessman. In the end try to maintain healthy risk to reward ratio and do money management. Cheers! Answer by, Ravi Rockade. By learning right method, how to find which method is right. If you get answer of every why with logic then it is logical. First of all know stock market in right way. Do not fall for wrong techniques. If anything seems illogical then do not follow it. Read this carefully. Trading with institutions is profitable as they make money 90% of the times. By knowing right and logical way. Important is understanding the truth about stock market which nobody tells you but everyone knows. Technical analysis is too risky because technical analysis doesn't work in stock market as it is lacking in illogical please do not fall for it. 95% people are failing in stock market and losing their hard earned money and when asked a technical analyst so called specialist. They says you 
you must be using wrong indicators or oscillators or you must be using improper parameters, and all sorts of nonsense answers they will give you, but no one dare to tell you that it doesn't work. Before talking about trading, you need to understand functionality of stock market. There are two types of traders, retail and institutions. Retail losses 95% of the times, and institutions win say no of times. So to make consistent money in stock market best solution is to follow institutions. How? Whenever institutions buys or sells they do it in volume. Volume is the only thing which differentiate institutions and retail. Watch this for better understanding.